If you ever want to know how to export your SketchUp model in a 2D CAD file drawing format, this is the right video for you. But before that, please don't forget to subscribe to this channel to keep you updated to our new video tutorials. Using this model, you can export any object, however, for the purposes of this tutorial, I will focus on exporting our house model to a 2D vector CAD file. So, I am going to hide the unnecessary model first. On the layer tab, after you click the object, you can see what layer it was assigned to. On your layer tray, click the I button to hide the object. To export your model in a 2D vector CAD file follow these steps. In the first place, let us determine what views we want to be exported as 2D CAD files. For this model, I want to export an isometric 2D view, a front view, a left side view, a right side view, and a back view. How to do it? Follow these steps. Go to the camera menu, in the standard views, select ISO. You can adjust the view a little bit to look nicer. Next, add animation scenes. Go to view menu at the end of the options select animation and click add scene. This is to add your first scene which is the ISO. Next, for the rest of the views, we need to maintain our model scale in the exported file. So, go to camera and select parallel projection. You will see then the views are in a parallel projection. Then, set the other views to any of SketchUp's standard views. Select camera then standard views and select an option from the submenu that appears. Let us begin with the front view. Next, right click the scene one at the top and click add. This is to add a scene using the current view display. Do the same thing for the rest of the sides or views. Now, we have this series of views seen for export. Select File, go to Export and choose 2D Graphic. Navigate to the place where you want to save your exported file. Change the file name if you'd like to name the exported file something other than the SketchUp file's current name. Select either the .dwg or .dxf file type. In Microsoft Windows, select this option from the Save as Type drop-down list. Then, click the Options button to set the scale and line options. When you're done, click OK in the DWG DXF Hidden Line Options dialog box. Click Export and your CAD file is saved in your selected location. Now let us see how the files are being exported. And this is beautiful. Let us see the other views as well. Front view. Left side view. Right side view. And here is the plan view or layout view. Thank you for watching.